Hello everyone, and welcome to today's episode of Casual Couch Gaming, with your host, Magnus Salami. Today, I will be playing Bomberman Generation. I hope you enjoy. So today we start off at World 1, Tanasia, at Octopi Woods. So we're joined by Bomberman. What's happening here? Aha, uh -huh. so it seems like a professor is telling us that we have to go into the forest. Uh, Bomber man, you can't run away yet. We have to finish off our adventure first. Talk about quitting before it even starts. As there's these weird floating balloon enemies floating around. And one seems to be stuck in amongst a whole bunch of what looks like pottery. And Bomberman defeats it without any problems at all. Hmm, what is Bomberman doing? Destroying these random pots? Ah, I see. The pots have may have items in them. Ooh, that was a close one. That tree almost ran into you. Well, almost hit you actually, sorry Bomberman. As Bomberman lays a trap for that balloon monster and kills it with not a problem at all. And Bomberman is laying bombs everywhere he can. Hmm. He's not being sparse about that at all. Where does Bomberman have to go now? Another random tree. Are you going to destroy that one too? I'm sure Bomberman can't be good for the environment, destroying every tree in sight. Hmm. Once Bomberman's done with this level, it'll be deforested. Instead of forest. That can't be good. Ah, Bomberman has just learnt how to pick up a bomb. Well, this uh, this is very interesting. What, what are you going to do with this bomb? Uh, please don't throw it at me. Throw it at the trees. Throw it at the enemy. It's anywhere but me. Um, no, you can't throw it at the entrance of the stage. That would be irresponsible. Ah, I see. To move the boulders, make a big yes, we've already figured that out. Um... Can you hurry up? I don't want to die by the bomb. <laughs> wow, talk about an intense situation. I was fearful that the bomb behind us was going to explode while the professor was explaining to us what we need to do. As Bomberman moves that big boulder out the way with no problem at all. It seems like Bomberman is not sparing any expense with those giant bombs. Seems like he's using them at every opportunity possible. Oh, Bomberman makes a line of bombs. Will he get both of those balloon enemies? No, he only manages to get one of them. Ooh, and he has now damaged himself by running into it. I see. So Bomberman now has two hearts, and it seems like when he gets injured, the full heart divides into three. Hmm, that's uh, quite interesting. Well, hopefully Bomberman can defeat these weird balloon monsters without any problems at all. And another one down. Where do we have to go now? Ah, there's a tree that's facing a riverside. I dare say... Timber! Nice. Now we cross that tree to get to the other side. More balloon monsters up ahead as Bomberman picks up another bomb and pumps it up. Nice. Making the balloon monster dizzy, we get a two for one with the giant blast. Nicely done, Bomberman. That's what I like to see. Good skills there, bud. But um, I don't know why you're waiting for these bombs to blow up. What's happening now? Use the big bomb. Okay, use it where exactly? Okay, so Bomberman moves back and throws the big bomb there. No, do we throw it here? Nope, the bomb goes in the water. I don't think that's where you're supposed to throw it, Bomberman. Are we supposed to throw it at that rock? Maybe. No, I don't think that did it. Try again. Nope, that one went straight into the water. Okay, that's a good idea. Moving to the ledge might work. Throw it as far as you can, Bomberman. Just like that. Let's see if we... What happens now? 
Timber! Ah, I see. There was a tree on the other side. Jump down into the tree stumps. Hmm. That seems a bit inconspicuous. Just random tree stumps? Where would they lead us? I have no idea, but we will soon find out. As these these weird black enemies prancing around. Just be careful, Bomberman. I have no idea what they are. As Bomberman defeats one without any issues, and he gets a heart and replenishes his life back to full. Nicely done, Bomberman. As Bomberman surveys the next area where there's only two items. Ooh. We got a speed up and a power up for our bomb power. Why are you throwing so many bombs around, Bomberman? We don't want to turn the forest into a desert wasteland now, do we? As I can hear more enemies in the background and a random item on its own. Is there anything here? Ah, a heart. Well, we're already on full life, so I guess it doesn't hurt to collect that. Ah. Oh, ouch. That was unexpected. Well, maybe we should have saved that heart. Seeing that you're being a little bit careless, Bomberman. Be careful. These guys are unpredictable. Ooh, nice. You stunned him. And destroyed by the bomb blast. Nicely done there, Bomberman. Are you going to drop that trap, that balloon monster? Did we get it? Yes, we did. Nice. And waiting for that last bomb to blow up. There we go. Beautiful. Um, now we are maxed out on bombs. As Bomberman heads to the next area where there's more of these weird looking enemies prancing around. What does Bomberman have to do? Aha. Same as before. There's a boulder here. Throw the bomb at the... At the boulder, I was about to say. Okay, you can throw it anywhere you want. And see what happens when you don't listen to me, Bomberman? You get hurt. And, oh, those bombs missed entirely. Ah, come on, Bomberman. Where was the skills that you were showing us earlier? Stop dilly-dallying. Show us what you're made of. Just like that. There you go. Standing back. Bomberman knocks the boulder into the river, blocking the water, and the water recedes. Opening up a path for Bomberman to proceed as he gets hit again by that weird black enemy. I don't know what he is, but he's running around shouting something. I really can't comprehend what he's saying. Best to leave him be, Bomberman. Just move on to the next area. He looks quite menacing and tricky, but he's not harming you, so just move on. As Bomberman now goes to the next area, what's this pink area? Is this a boss? Is this a friend? What is it? Aha! Bomberman has met his first Charabomb or Carabomb and Lar. It seems like Bomberman has made his first companion. Nice. I wonder what this companion does. Let's find out, shall we? Ah, greater height and distance of thrown bombs. Well, that's going to be handy for us. Okay, so that will definitely help us out. And we don't need to keep collecting the bomb up power ups, but they seem to be quite common. Containers may hold carabomb feed. Collect the feed and your carabomb will become strong. Well, that's always a good uh, good thing to do. We want our companion to become stronger. With a stronger companion, Bomberman will become stronger also. Nice, and he's already hit level 4. Well, that didn't take long at all. To the next area. And there's these weird floating... Use bomb kicks. Okay, we have bomb kicks. I didn't even know. It seems when Bomberman gets too close to those um, flowers, they sink down into the ground. But underneath them is a little bit of a hole. So it looks like we've got to play golf with the bombs and get them into the flowers. Ooh, almost. Third time's a charm, Bomberman. There you go, just like that. 
and the flower opens up revealing a pot. Huh, nice. I like little mini games like this. It makes the game quite interesting. Ooh, Bomberman didn't quite get that one. Are we going to try again? You gotta move back a bit, Bomberman. There you go. Just like that. Nope, too far. And too fast. Oh, oh there's another one. We'll try that one first. First shot. Beautiful. Nicely done. Now we'll go for that last one again. You know, you could have kicked another bomb while you're waiting for that one to blow up. I don't know why you're wasting so much time, Bomber Man. Efficiency. Efficiency is key here. I don't know why Bomber Man seems to like to waste a lot of time. And I don't know what pumping up a bomb is going to achieve as we go to the next area. Oh, it looks like we came... We're back where we came from. Now this is where you originally were, Bomber Man. You need to go the other direction. Your other left. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, so Bomber Man is now at an area where there's more of these weird balloon enemies as one of them walks straight into Bomber Man's trap. Nicely placed there, Bomber Man. Will we get another two for one? Nope. The other one just managed to get out, but Bomberman traps it in a C-shaped trap and defeats it without a problem. Off to the next area, and there's a weird flying pterodactyl. Hmm. I didn't realize we were in the Stone Ages here, but I didn't think bombs were invented back then. Well, it seems to be harmless for the time being. Where are you going, Bomber Man? You've already been there before. Okay. And we can't cross there yet because water is preventing us from going past. We have to find another way around. Are you going to defeat that flying monster? I don't think we have the ability to do so at this time. Best to leave it alone. Oh, I think we've angered it. Quick, Bomber Man, run before it kills you. I don't think it's too pleased about us trying to kill it. I kind of figured that. We have to cross the bridge to get to the next area. Thanks uh, for letting us know, genius. I couldn't have figured that one out myself. And Bomber Man picks up another speed up. Ooh, mini games. I like mini games. Ooh, a bomb merge item, huh? Well, this should be interesting, but I dare say we should probably start wrapping up the mission, Bomber Man, and leave it for next time. Okay, so Bomber Man enters the bonus game, and we will end it here, ladies and gents. Thanks for watching. Magnus. Tsunami. Drop.